नमस्ते नमस्ते शमला दीदी नमस्ते ऑल गुड मॉर्निंग एंड वेलकम टू द मॉर्निंग सेशन जी नमस्ते सुनील जी नमस्ते टू एवरीबॉडी गुड मॉर्निंग वेलकम सो वी हैव बीन डूइंग एक्सरसाइज टू फॉर द पास सेवरल डेज ऑब्जर्विंग द सेल्फ एंड द बॉडी बाय द सेल्फ आफ्टर एक्सरसाइज वन observing the self by the self now in addition to observing the self we are also observing the body and our interaction with the body so in step 1 we were trying to observe that i am there as a reality i exist as a self i can see my activities within me so i can see that i exist i also know that the body is there and i can see that the body is there how by reading the sensations from the body even though i may see with the eyes that is also a sensation in step 2 we were trying to see this interaction between the self and the body that this interaction is only in the form of information there is nothing physical or physiochemical that is being transferred from the self to the body or from the body to the self it is just information instructions to the body and reading sensations from the body in step 3 we were trying to see who is deciding who is the decision maker in this whole interaction between the self and the body is it the self or is it the body and we were i think for for the most part able to see that i am the one i meaning the self is the one who is deciding who is the decision maker the self is the one that is the seer the doer and the enjoyer the one who sees the one who observes self is also the doer essentially because the self is deciding what to be done and then giving the instruction to the body and then the body follows and then when it comes to experiencing the sensation through the body this part also you may be able to see that it is i who experience when i taste something i either like or dislike the taste so i decide and i am the one who experience the taste so i may see a movie i decide whether i like the movie or i dislike the movie the body just sits in the hall on a chair without any activity so yesterday we had talked briefly about we had tried to do this exercise of sitting in one place in 10 minutes for 10 minutes and not moving and trying to see that are you able to stay in this position or is it that you change your position and if you change the position to try and observe this interaction with the body who is deciding the change in position was it the self or was it the body so if we could draw some conclusions from this also if we could see we had discussed this 
at other times before how much time we are spending interacting with the body and how much time we are spending just being busy with ourselves without awareness of the body and you may be able to see that you are not really interacting with the body each and every moment are you able to see this you may be able to notice some sensation in that area i think we can all do this if you just close your eyes for a moment just take your attention to any one part of the body let's say we take our attention to the thumb now keep your focus on the thumb pay attention to the thumb do you feel any sensation there namaste didi namaste didi uh, i was just trying to understand that uh, there is a exchange of information um, between the body and the self mm -hmm. but suppose uh, we are driving a car and then something uh, or somebody comes in front of us then without thinking for a second or moment the body just acts the brake gets pressed so i'm not able to understand whether the body is trained that way or the self is instructing it i feel like the body also has its own uh, capacity and memory it is not all the time self instructing the body so i just want to understand this uh, phenomena yeah if you sort of pay attention to it you will find that many of these so called reflex automatic actions also the self is deciding we can do one more um, example now see when you uh, we say that you know it is automatic for the body to take a breath because you can't survive without breathing now if you hold your breath for a few minutes notice what is happening what is happening in the body and what is happening in you what are your thoughts and see that when you take the breath who has decided it you or the body if you observe uh, it closely you will get your answer shall we do this for a few minutes uh yes didi we can do and i understand that it is the self uh, which has the power to interfere in the actions of the body you are not saying it has the power to interfere in the actions of the body only there are mm -hmm. some things that the body has its own self organization but there also i have decided to associate with the body the moment i decide not to associate with the body it's all over for the body isn't it let's yeah. all of us do this for a few minutes as per your comfort just hold your breath hold your breath stop breathing and try to see the interaction between the self and the body and keep holding your breath till you feel that you can't hold it any longer and notice what happens when i am holding it up after uh, some time it just gets very uncomfortable mm -hmm. then i just decide to breathe yeah, yeah. you give the instruction to the body mm -hmm. to breathe mm -hmm. if you choose not to breathe you can decide that also but what happens is we don't see ourselves separate from the body very clearly and mm -hmm. we have a strong will to live Hmm. so we think that if the body dies i am gone hmm and so we don't want to let go so hmm. we will not give that instruction to the body that you know don't breathe we will not give such an instruction to the body why would you but we are not paying attention also to the instructions that we are giving it is happening very quickly very fast 
So the next time something is happening like this, try to pay attention to. Uh, but uh, we cannot give the same instruction to our heart, isn't it? See, in the case of the heart, for the self-organization in the body to be there, there is something that is many of these activities that are going on in the body. As part of its own self-organization, these activities may be going on. But I certainly have the power to change this. So you will notice that um, you may not be doing anything with the body. But you just have some fear in you. Right? You will notice heart is beating faster. You will notice the palms, there is sweat forming on the palms. Now, is this the body or is it the self? If you didn't have those thoughts, the body would have continued in the same way. Okay, we'll try to do this exercise again. So choose a comfortable posture. Try not to change the body position. For 10 minutes, we'll observe what is happening. Observe the interaction with the body. Observe who is deciding. So take your comfortable position. Give instruction to the body not to move for 10 minutes. Now, if there is movement in the body, observe who decided, self or body. I uh, completely observed my thoughts and body separately. Mm -hmm. And it was, I was able to observe the sensations. Mm -hmm. It was so relaxing. Mm -hmm. I could be able to see, separate my thoughts as well as my body sensations. Mm -hmm. We'll do this exercise all day today. We have to just try to observe the interaction very closely. Even in the reflex actions, even when you're driving, all of that. Try to observe very closely. Namaste Kumar Bhaiya. Namaste Didi. Namaste Sabiko.